while the good bad mother is a near perfect show, we absolutely hate the fact that the emotional complexity of the relationship between Young Soon and Kang Ho was simply reduced to circumstantial. On the other hand, it was touching to see the different parent-child relationships explored through the other characters. This is how it unfolds through the recap of episode 12. There is a lot more to the fire at Happy Pig Farm than what meets the eye of the villagers of Dri. Except that Samsik knew that Kang Ho must be in trouble, just as he thought, when he reached the pig farm, he found two men coming out, and it was clear that they had set fire to the place. Mr. Soon and Mr. Cha, rescue him yet again, and by that time, even the villagers reach there and are able to help young Soon. Sam Sik tries to get inside the farm to save Kang Ho, but it is the latter who carries him out on his back and passes out. Kang Ho and Sam Sik are admitted to the hospital, and while the former is seemingly unconscious, Young Soon and Miju have a heart to heart. Miju tells Young Soon that Kang Ho always missed her, and he never resented her, as she was thinking. This makes Young Soon realize that Miju was the girl that Kang Ho had been in love with and was forced to leave behind for the sake of his revenge. When Miju admits that Yi Jun and Seo Jin are Kang Ho's kids, Young Soon tells her the true motives behind her son's actions. Unknown to the women, Kang Ho is already awake and he has heard everything that the two spoke about. He is teary-eyed enough at the unexpected sacrifices of the people around him when he is taken away by the police under the suspicion of killing Huang Su Hian, the mother of Ote Su illegitimate son. Ote Su and Song Wu Bai Yak are trying to frame the entire thing on Kang Ho since the assemblyman has way too much proof against Wu Bai Yak and is threatening him with it unless he cooperates. At the police station, Kang Ho wants to avoid the answers and the interrogation at all costs and fakes a fit, forcing the inspectors to take the mother and son home. However, Young Soon has sensed that Kang Ho has recovered his memories and is extremely happy. Kang Ho tells her that he must go to Seoul to sort out the matter since they will always be in danger until it is all resolved. Before leaving, Kang Ho meets Miju and asks her to hold on to her anger a while longer till he takes care of things. While Kang Ho is out on his mission, Miju makes a chilling discovery of her own. She finds a video on her daughter's cell phone that she recorded when Kang Ho visited his mother with Ha Young. Yi Jin had caught on camera. Ha Young spiking Kang Ho's drink. When Miju shows this to Sam Sik, they both understand that they must help Kang Ho by getting to Ha Young. Injury. Young Soon is a new woman now that Kang Ho is alright, and she knows that he does not need a guardian for the rest of his life. The Trot Singer. Huna apologizes to her, and she helps him throw a feast for the rest of the villagers as his farewell since he is leaving the next day. It is evident that she is extremely happy, and even gets drunk on a single glass of alcohol. Good days might finally be there for her. When Miju and Samsik reach Ote Su's house, they find that it is not easy to meet Ha Young. Miju pretends to be her friend, and after some exaggerated melodrama, she gets it out from one of the staff that Ha Young is in a hospital until the presidential election. While they are scratching their heads trying to figure out where Ha Young could be, Miju remembers that she had met her previously. Ha Young was the rude customer that Miju had to deal with in episode 1 of The Good Bad Mother. She remembers how Ha Young tried to get payback by fabricating a fake medical certificate. The point is that the name of the hospital on the certificate was Wu's Medical Center and Miju figures out that it is where Ha Young must be kept. She and Sam Six set off to meet her and understand what exactly happened on the day of Kang Ho's accident and whether she could help them save his life. Meanwhile, Kang Ho is being pushed into a corner by Oh Tae Su and Song Wu Bai Yak, who want to frame him for the murder of Huang Su Hian. The only ace up Kang Ho's sleeve is that nobody knows that he has regained his memories. He must find proof that he did not kill the woman before he presents the truth of her involvement with Ote Su. He is looking for the man who is supposed to take Su Hian away in his boat, Cho Young Jie. That day, Kang Ho had left the woman with him to be taken to a different country, but something happened that caused her to end up dead in the sea. Kang Ho needs to find Cho Young Jie to investigate that, and at the end of episode 12 of The Good Bad Mother, he finds the man's boat and the first step of his investigation. We know from the precap of the Good Bad Mother episode 13 that Sam Sik and Miju are going to find Kang Ho and help him meet Ha Young. 
some of the latent tensions and hurt feelings are going to be resolved with these three. On the other hand, Song Wu Bai Yak knows that Kang Ho double crossed him and might look for him. Obviously, he will go to his village, and upon not finding him there, he might try to harm Young Soon. She is still a vulnerable card that can be used against Kang Ho, and it remains to be seen how that happens.